of only a few in the state of Indiana offering an explorer program. It's a chance for 14 to 20 year olds to get hands on experience in law enforcement. This year, the department hopes to expand the program. I would have had a lot of fun with this program. The Tippecanoe County Explorers program wasn't around when Deputy Aaron Gilman entered the field. I don't know how knowledgeable people are that this program exists, and it's one that I think would make a, a big impact on somebody who has an interest in law enforcement. Someone like Brock Suter, who wants to be a deputy someday. It's encouraged me more, and I've seen how people uh, interact with us and how they're appreciative of what we do. But sometimes people aren't so appreciative. The perception of law enforcement has changed over the years. Sheriff Bob Goldsmith believes it's one reason people aren't as willing to become an officer. Personal opinion would be um, everybody's being recorded and they cut out the entire interaction and really show the one part that would be construed as negative from law enforcement. Goldsmith believes the Explorer program could help. Participants like Nicholas Serdic could act as a spokesperson for law enforcement. Try to explain to them that they're not bad people, they're normal people as well. They're just here to make sure that we're being safe and stuff. Deputy Gilman says the national conference at Purdue last year inspired them to expand the program. Is that number 50 kids? Is it 100? I don't know. But an expansion doesn't have to include an increase in participation. Gilman hopes to enhance the program in other ways, too. Equipment, the experience, reaching out to competitions, and, and really letting the community know that we're here and we're a resource. Explorers are excited for the future of the program. And hopefully they'll come out and apply to be with our post and grow with us. If you're interested in volunteering to help or applying for the program, visit our website, WLFI.com. Well, Martin Luther King Jr. Day means it's also a day of